You might know Ohio as the birthplace of aviation. What you might not know is we're becoming a growing hub for aerospace and defense innovation. Now another national company is putting one of its central hubs right here in Columbus with a big announcement on the progress just shared today. There's something new taking flight in Ohio. Ohio has always been this aerospace state, uh, going back to the Wright brothers. And today, we continue that tradition. Just this year, big aerospace names like Anderil Industries and Airbus have announced new partnerships right here in central Ohio. Businesses are leaving the coast. They're going to places all over. You hear about Texas and, and you hear about Colorado and you hear about Tennessee, but they're they're coming to Ohio in greater and greater numbers. Now, Ohio is adding Voyager Technologies to the roster, a company at the forefront of space exploration. We're building our own commercial space station to replace the International Space Station. So it's, it's really a wonderful time, both on the uh, national level and now on the state level as well. And Central Ohio will take part in that mission. This is the bedrock of American manufacturing. The blueprints are in to create the first ever science park in the United States right at Ohio State. And Voyager has selected local developer Elford Construction to spearhead the project. The Voyager Institute for Space Technology and Advancement will have leasable offices, meeting areas, and laboratories, allowing for more space companies to move in and do business right here in Columbus. The reputation of Ohio, the quality of the engineering students coming out of Ohio State University, the companies that are coming here, uh, that's something that we'll be very pleased to be part of. Through the partnership, this cutting edge innovation center will help drive the space industry as an epicenter of research in space and manufacturing and a boost to jobs and the economy in the Buckeye State. Because Ohio is a state that builds things. so. Um, Aerospace industry is well suited to be here, and we've got population and workforce to match, but we're gonna to have to invest and, and make sure our young kids in school know that this career is here for them and uh, they can build toward it. Ohio State spokesperson Ben Johnson says the university is excited about this next step in the process and looks forward to what it will offer its staff, students, and researchers for years to come. Now this partnership with Ohio State will complete the Ohio trifecta in space enterprise with the state's national security hub at Wright-Patterson Air Force Base and civil space hub at NASA's Glenn Research Center and Armstrong Test Facility. We had an exclusive opportunity to sit down with Voyager's president of International and Space Station, Jeffrey Manber. You can watch my full interview with him now on 10TV.com. For 10TV, I'm Meredith Garfalo.